Welcome back, everybody. Hope you're having a great day. We are still down here in the depths of the police station. So I need to do a few things. First, I need to put some walls in here. So I'm just going to go with the same wall design that I'm going with over there. I think I may mix it up a little bit. Get up here. So I think I've got some plain old diorite. I thought I, if I did this, will that work? No, that's not going to work. So maybe there. Try to think of a nice little pattern here. So maybe something like that. I think I did something similar in here. Yeah, on the walls, I did something similar over here. And that was really just so I could hang the item frames nicely. In this case, I'm just going for a different design, trying to break up the solid, solid wall. So we'll do something like that. Oops, and where's my polished? And I will have to just carry these headers across. So they're going to go all the way across where the walls are. That way it'll give the ceiling something to grab a hold of. And then I will need to put in some birch, which I don't have in my hand right now. But it's so like the walls would do this. And then here, like that. Strip that out. I think I can. Well, let's let's just put in a diorite header there. And you know, this is kind of small to be putting a design in, so I'm probably going to leave it that way. And then even between the two rooms, I'm not going to put anything right at the uh, corner here because this door is so close. There was normally you'd put, you know, the wood right there. Not going to do that. We're just going to do it this way. And then this would be a solid wall. And then we'll just have to get the polish. I don't have the polish on me have to get the polished die right and go across the top. So let me put in all the walls down here and put in the ceiling with some lights and then we can get around to doing some decorations in here. Because we'll have this is a main office here. I have another office here with a so this is a bigger office so this is more of a probably more important person. And then this whole place is going to be cafeteria. So I have a feeling we're going to have like vending machine food over on that side and then tables all through here. And then maybe just disposal garbage and stuff here where you drop off your trays and stuff. I guess first we're going to need walls, we're going to need a ceiling. So I guess I better get started on that. So... I want to put in a light. Oh, I was going to put a light hanging from there, but... Oh, there we go. I thought it wasn't working. Yeah. Okay. We are down here again, where I have finished putting in all the walls. So we, I've got all my offices scoped out. All the walls are in for uh, the cafeteria and stuff. Ceiling is in, so we have these... You know, ceiling lights going all the way down all the hallways and stuff. And then you get into here. This is one of the offices. So I'm just going to set this thing up. Of course, it's an even number. So that means it's going to make it much, much harder to put a chair in here that looks balanced. Because you want it kind of centered. 
So we will do that. So this will be a bigger chair for the office chair. And then we'll have our desk. And then there. Oops, and then dark oak. There. So we have our desk there. And I'm going to want another chair here and a chair here. I should have made these even. It's kind of disappointing. I mean odd instead of even. But we'll survive. So we got two chairs there. Got that. Um, I got some this and this and this and this. So I'm going to put a plant over in that corner. So like maybe that. And then I think another one over in this corner. There. Three of them door and then I want to put just a couple banners here for decoration maybe a portrait there um, let's do that there we go didn't want that other big that big one in there so yeah so this is looking not too bad do what I'm going to put in one of those there, I think. Yeah, I think that's your own. I want to put in like a couple bookcases in that corner. And then maybe like a file cabinet over there. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. So that is office numero one. So we have this bigger office here. That's good. This corner area is going to be not a lounge, but it's kind of a little couch sitting area. So we'll do that. That. There. Got a little coffee pot there. I think that'll be okay. And then I got the same problem here with the with this the it's an even number instead of an odd number. So it's uh, kind of disappointing that I didn't catch that before. I'm gonna push this one back just a little bit. But the desk is going to be the same style and everything, so it's going to look almost identical to the one over there. That's good. And then I can do, let's do two seats there, like that. Um, let's put... A bookcase there and file cabinet. Um, yeah, I can do that. And it might crowd the door a little bit. Is it going to crowd the door? It actually doesn't. It actually lines up perfectly with the door. Well, that'll work. That works out fine right there. Got that. Um, I don't think I want to cover this with a picture. Although I may cover this other one over here with the picture. There. Yeah, so far so good. Put a flower pot there. So 
That doesn't look too bad. Yes, I think yeah, I don't think I need anything else over here. Oh yeah, I wanted that's what I wanted. Yeah, so we got a bench here with the coffee maker and stuff. Have everything else through here. So I think that works for this office. So two offices down. I got one more to go. Actually, not an office. I've got a cafeteria. So this area here is going to be the big cafeteria. So I need to get um, probably some cooking areas or like a little kitchen area over here. Uh, we'll have a bunch of chairs and tables out through this way and then a cleanup area over there you know with like I'm calling it like a couple garbage bins right there and a counter well, I guess we can start over here we'll just put a counter there trash can continue the counter Kind of like maybe a beverage station here. And then I was thinking a fridge. Just so you can store stuff. Refrigerator there. And then maybe this side over here is more cooking area. So you have a, a few ovens. Got a uh, cook counter there. And if we go around this side, give us plenty of room, and then we can stick in the sink. A couple more counters and the garbage can. So I think that's kind of the cooking eating area there. Although I don't have any. Yeah, do I have a? Um, need some blocks. I think I need a crafting table and. Maybe some barrels. Do I have any barrels? Oh, I do have some barrels. That's good. Oh, and I also got some spruce, so that'll work. And I probably should have brought that coarse dirt with me. But So let's do a couple of those. So maybe I'm going to stick one of these in the corner here, sort of anchor that counter. And then maybe put one... Put one over here on this end. There. And then you're going to stick the barrels up here, kind of like cabinets. Yeah, so I think that'll be okay there. So this is the eating area. And I need to get the seating. So we got seating and eating. So we get the dark oak. And dang it, I forgot. Forgot what I needed. So I'm going to need a bunch of string. So I'm going to have a bunch of that. Also going to do... So I've got some uh, wool. I'm going to convert to wool to carpet. And then we're going to do this. Yeah, that should give me what I need to get started. So let's start over here. At least I've got the luxury. I can pick a center. So like here, here. That's the center. I need to go here and there. And then this. And that makes a table. The only other thing I thought was maybe if I stick a back on it. I can't do anything here. No, that doesn't look good. But I can do that. So that's one table there. And I need another table over here. I think I'm just going to do this. This. Um, and this. And do that table. Although the colors do kind of blend in with everything.
like that. That's good. That's looking good so far. And maybe make another table here. There. Tables have enough room between them so they don't feel cramped. We do this. There, that should do that. Just a few touches to go here. And we should be about done. I'm going to put a brewing stand here. I think that'll be okay. And I'm just going to stick a flower in the corner here. And I think that looks good. Now over here... I think we could put another plant, maybe one of these. Yeah, that'll be fine. And do I actually have room for any more? I do have room for some here. Let's do this. So like that. And then we have this in there. I did bring in um, some of these leaves, but I don't really have a place for them that fits in nicely. I mean, I could cram them into the corner or something, but that's a bit, uh, I think that's kind of forcing the issue. The only other thing I'm going to add in here is, uh, where do I want to put this? We'll put this over here by the front door. I've got a, a, a jukebox here. So in case someone wants to play music, we can turn on the jukebox and play some music. Other than that, I think that is all I've got uh, for the cafeteria here. I mean, I could put item frames with food and stuff, but, you know, the more item frames, the more lag you get. So I'm just going to avoid that for now. So I am done for today. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching. I'm hoping you're having a nice day. And uh, come back and see me in the next episode. We will move over here into the jail cells and get all these uh, worked out. And then maybe work on the uh, tunnel that goes all the way to the other side of the island. So, till then, see you later and have a nice day. Bye-bye.